first at 11, we are tracking the tropics and they are busy. The just named Tropical Storm Hannah on the left, Tropical Storm Gonzalo on the right. The season is active and there's a long way to go. Good evening, I'm Lauren Pastrana. And I'm Elliot Rodriguez. The good news is there are no threats to South Florida right now. And our weather is improving just in time for the weekend. Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer is tracking it all and leads us off tonight at 11. Craig. Yep, we're going to start with Gonzalo this evening. Not much change from the earlier advisory. Winds still at 60 miles an hour. That might be kind of generous. We won't know really what's going on inside Gonzalo until hurricane hunters investigate the storm sometime tomorrow. Moving to the west at 14 miles an hour, what we do is we use satellite observations to to look at patterns to basically assume or estimate uh, the wind speed there and also the pressure, the pressure is estimated. Now here's the future track and there's still this window of opportunity for it to strengthen a little bit and possibly become a hurricane. That would be sometime Friday night into Saturday and by Saturday evening, Saturday and Saturday evening reaching the islands there, but then it runs into a lot of dry air and really starts to weaken quickly. In fact, it may not even make it this far into the Caribbean. This is the last forecast point from the National Hurricane Center. Now, if it were to continue, they'd have another point out here, but this is the end of the track for Gonzalo here. It's forecast to be dissipated. We're up here in South Florida. Obviously, we're feeling good about the situation, but we always watch a tropical system when it's in that part of the Atlantic or in the Caribbean. You can see Gonzalo down there, just kind of that little red ball. Compare that to Hannah tonight. And by the way, Hannah, the H storm, this is the earliest H storm ever on record. So we're uh, pretty far into the alphabet and not that far into the season. But look what's going on with Hannah tonight. You see these lines of thunderstorms now starting to form. These are called, uh, this is called banding. And typically when a tropical system takes on banding features, it means it's getting better organized and it's getting stronger. In fact, winds at 40 miles an hour with Hannah. It's moving to the west, northwest. Forecast to continue to strengthen some before it reaches the Texas coast. That's during the day on Saturday. And then it's going to slow down and be a big, big rainmaker for much of Mexico, Texas, even parts of Louisiana. As far as we're concerned, still some rain out there. Big area of thunderstorms coming in tonight. It's going to be a stormy night for parts of South Florida, but there is some sunshine and this forecast. And I'll have that coming up in just a bit.